guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Ritu. Today I will be leading you through a very short sequence how to release tension from your upper back. So there are a few exercises that we're going to do and feel free to repeat them or save this video so you can do them often. And if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, go ahead and do that. And again, if you are a subscriber, thank you so much guys. I, I appreciate you. So let's go ahead and get started. The first movement that we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and nicely open up our shoulders. So let's go ahead and take a moment here to reach your hands all the way up, all the way back and down. Let's do three. Let's go ahead and do two. Let's do one more. Perfect. We're going to reverse that for a count of three. Gently round forward. Let's go ahead and do two. Let's go ahead and do one more. Really good. Now with your next breath, you're going to just go ahead and take your hands on either side. My dog is right here. I don't want to step on his tail. We're going to take our hands all the way out. So really reach it all the way further away from you. You should feel that sternum pushing forward, but then your pectoral is going forward. The shoulder is going back. It's a nice little extension. We're going to go ahead and slowly turn our right palm down. You're going to look to the left. Go ahead and come all the way back in. The left palm turns back, shoulder caves in. You're going to look to the right. Really good. Coming back in. We're going to go ahead and turn. Gently come back in. Let's do a couple more. Come back in. We're going to do one more. We're going to go ahead and turn out. Let's go ahead and come back in. This would be a final one. And we're going to come all the way back in. Gently release it down. We're going to slowly start with the very first movement here. So we're going to slowly start by taking your hands all the way out. You're going to come onto your eagle's arm. So modification is to just grab your opposite shoulders if this uh, full eagle is difficult for you. Now when you're doing this, the whole goal is for your elbows to go forward. You have this gentle rounding. Now if you are able to do the full posture, we're going to do the right side. You're going to go ahead and cross your right arm on top of your left. And go ahead and slowly um, start to press your hand all the way forward. So the forearm goes forward. It's a nice little rounding. From here, you're going to keep pressing it forward. It's a gentle push up. It's a slow drop down. You're here for a count of three. Let's drop. Let's go ahead and do two. It's a drop. Let's go ahead and do one. It's a drop all the way down. Really good. Just release it down and then shake it out. We're going to go ahead and do that one more time. You're going to go ahead and take your left on top of your right. Again, modification is to gently grab your opposite shoulders. And all you want to do is push it forward and it's a nice little lift and a slow drop down. If you're doing a full posture, you're going to slowly, it's a nice little lift. You're going to push your forearms forward. It's a gentle lift. It's a slow drop. It's a gentle lift. It's a slow drop. You were here for a count of three. Let's drop. Let's do two. It's a drop. Let's do one more. And it's a nice little drop. Really good. Release it all the way down. We're going to slowly start to open up our chest a little bit more. So you're going to start with a nice little opening. Think about taking your hands up into a Y shape, really reaching through your fingers. You want to really think that you're lifting through the sides of your body. And then as you exhale, go ahead and bend it into a nice little W. Really good. Again, inhale, extend it to the Y. As you exhale, nice little W. Really good. Last three. Inhale. Let's go ahead and bend. Last two. Inhale. Let's go ahead and bend. Final one. Let's go ahead and bend. Really good. Release it all the way down. From here, we're going to slowly start to reach our hands all the way high. You're going to lengthen. You're going to interlace your fingers, slowly flip your grip. You're just going to take a side body bend to the right. Gently come back in. It's a side body bend to the left. Gently come back in. Let's go ahead and do this for six. Come back in. Let's go ahead and do this for five. Come back in. We are here for four. Come back in. Let's go ahead and do this for three. Come back in. Let's do this for two. We're going to come back in. The 
this is a final one. We're gonna come all the way back in, really good. Release it down, just shake it out. We're gonna do a nice little neck stretch here. So you're gonna take your right hand. You're going to slowly take your right hand all the way back. Now you can absolutely keep it here if you have a little bit of a tightness. Now if you feel like you can add a little bit more, what I want you to do is I want you to take your hand a little bit higher. So imagine you can touch your left shoulder blade. So the right fingers can touch your left shoulder blade. You're going to take it a little bit higher. Now from here, all you want to do is you want to just go ahead and take your head all the way towards the left. You should feel this nice little extension, but then push your right shoulder back. You're going to gently bring it back. And we're going to do that three more times. It's a nice little opening. Slowly bring it back in. Last two. Gently come back in. We're going to do a final one. This time you're going to stay here. Notice on how you feel. And if you feel like you need to add a little bit more, just gently bring your eyes all the way down towards the left pinky toe. You're going to slowly lift up. Last two. You're going to come up. It's a final one. You're going to go ahead and come up. Really good. Lift your head all the way up. Release that hand down. Just shake it out. Same thing on the other side. You're going to go ahead and take your left hand. You can absolutely put it on your lower to lower back, which is totally fine. If you feel like you can go a little bit higher, take it to your right shoulder blade or take it a little bit across your body. Now, again, this is a really good posture. You can absolutely stay here just like this. And all you want to do is you want to slowly start to take your head all the way to the right, but push your left shoulder back. You're going to gently go ahead and come up. It's a nice little drop of your right ear to your right shoulder. You're going to go ahead and come all the way up. Last two. Come all the way up. Let's do a final one. This time you can stay here just like this or you can look down towards your right pinky toe. You're going to lift up. Look down towards your right pinky toe. Lift all the way up. Let's do one more time. Right pinky toe. Lift all the way up. Really good. Lift your head all the way back up and you're going to release your hand down. Just shake it out. This is the final movement that we're going to do. You're going to go ahead and bring your hands on your hips. If you can take it further back, absolutely do that. But for this class, we're just going to bring it to our hips. So your shoulder blades are rounded. Your shoulder blades are moving forward. Your shoulders are rounding. Totally okay. What you want to do is you want to think about pushing your elbows back open up your chest. And then as you're ready for an exhale, it's a nice little moving forward. Find that rounding again. Let's go ahead and do this for three. You're going to come back in. Let's go ahead and do this for two. Come back in. Let's do it for one more breath. Come all the way back in. Really good. Just kind of shake it out. And if you want to do this a little bit more, go ahead and repeat this video one more time. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, go ahead and subscribe. And thank you so much, guys, for being here. If you have requests for any other future videos, leave a comment down below. Or you can always just reach out to me in any of my social media. I will see you next time. Rico says bye to you. Bye, guys. Thank you so much.